years ago, I actually tracked her down. Knocked at her door, thinking she'd welcome me with open arms, but she had a new life and a new name. Maureen Prescott. You were the only child she claimed, Sydney. She shut me out in the cold forever. Her own son. Hey guys, Wolf Predator 101 here. Uh, today I'm coming to you with a review of my um, Easter Unlimited Fun World Ghostface tag as seen in the motion picture Scream Ghostface Mask. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff to remember. Um, let's just call it the Ghostface Tagged Easter Unlimited Fun World Ghostface. <laughs> that's basically the same I just told you. Anyhow, I got this bad boy off of eBay and I ordered it maybe two weeks, a week and a half, two weeks ago. And it just got here today after I got home from school. And uh, yeah, it's spankadelic, man. I love it. I ordered it from a guy in Ireland because it always rains in Ireland. Ooh. Yeah, I gotta do that when it's Ireland. It's Ireland, yeah, baby. Anyhow. Uh, that it took a bit longer to get here because uh, the guy I the guy I ordered it from he actually sent me a message. He's a great eBayer, man. He was like a hundred percent, I don't know, uh, reliable buy, uh, seller. Um, he actually sent me a message apologizing that it's gonna take a bit longer because he there was an error on my when he on the package when he wrote my address. Uh, my address, and um, he got it. Got it. He got the package sent back to him, return to sender style. Um, so he sent it again. So he actually apologized to me that it takes that it took a bit longer. I think his name is um, Supernat Supernatural Coffee or something. I think uh, you. Yeah, something like that. Anyhow, <clears throat> he's a great guy. Or a seller. Uh, this mask is spankadelic. It's fucking awesome, man. If you don't like profanity, this video is not for you. Yes, it is. This video is for everyone. Just, uh, yeah, don't care. Don't, don't give a shit about the profanity. It's my video. I say whatever I want. Anyhow, this is the scream mask. I, I freaking love it. I fudging love it. There you go. Um, this is the first uh, Ghostface scream mask that I've owned that is a uh, official one from Fun World. The uh, I've only owned one other Ghostface mask, and that was a knockoff from a local from a local um, toy store. And that one was kind of green slash yellow, and it glowed green in the dark. This one, however, is completely white, not yellow or, or anything. But it does glow in the dark. What the fudge, right? There's uh, no indication. The glow in the dark ones are supposed to have a yellow kind of star here that says glows in the dark. Uh, this one does not. The seller didn't, didn't list it. Did not list it as a glow in the dark. Uh, it doesn't glow green, it glows white, and uh, I'm asking you guys now that, is it supposed to be like that? Do all the normal non-glow ghost face masks, uh, when they're white, do all of them glow white in the dark? Or is it only these uh, ghost face tag ones? I just, wa just want to know, I just want some answers, man. Uh, so yeah, give me some answers on this. And yeah, get back to me. Okay, on to the review of the actual mask. I'm sorry it took so long. Um, the mask is spankadelic, man. It's awesome, tacular. It's, um, the material is um, great on the hands. It's what I'd expect a scream mask to feel like. Even though I haven't felt one for like, you know, eight years, maybe. Uh, I just love that smell. This smell is exactly like my uh, knockoff scream mask I had when I was younger. And this smell is just. It's the definition of Halloween for me. When I smell that, it feels like Halloween all over again when I was a kid. Uh, yeah, it's really flexible like this. It doesn't break or anything when you do it. 
Oh, please don't. I hope I did not jinx myself now. No. Um, I love the netting on the eyes. You can't really see through them in a dark environment. When it's when it's kind of light, you can see through, but that's not really a problem. Now it's... No, I don't think so. The entire mask is the same material, except for... Well, not except for... The, no, the nostrils of the nose and the inside of the mouth. Um, I th they are... I think... I'm pretty sure they're the same material, only they're thicker. Because they don't bend together as well, and of course I managed to bend it when I was going to show you it can't bend that well, but uh, believe me, the nose and the mouth are a lot more stubborn and uh, to bend, so I think it's the same material, only thicker. Um, yeah, great mask. As you can see, it's kind of disformed on this side. You see this side looks good, this side is, maybe you can't see it, but I, I can see it, that's the most important. I just have to kind of warm it and then shove something down his, uh, shove something down his uh, insides, so it will pop back out. Um, yeah, you can see the insides if you want. Mm, yeah. Here. Kind of can see how disformed the chin is right there. And it's quite comfortable to wear, and I don't have any problems with it yet. Um, yeah. And this is a definitely recommended mask for collectors and movie fanatics, especially horror genre. Uh, me personally, I love Ghostface. He is my favorite horror film killer ever and the Scream movies are basically the only horror films I watch. I mean, I watch the Texas Chainsaw sometimes, but yeah. That's mostly because I love Arlie Ermy. Ghostface is my favorite. Uh, so yeah, this mask is, is definitely recommended for collectors. I'm not going to collect these. I just wanted the one because I misplaced my other one. And I'm thinking of doing a live action with some friends. And then I'm going to try and do a robe if I can get some material from Grandma or something. Gram Gram. Um, so yeah, definitely a recommended mask. I'm talking to you, Martin. 446, 446, whatever you, your name is, I'm just gonna call you Martin. Uh, I'm guessing since you're you live in the Netherlands that your name is pronounced differently. Since you spell it with a J, Martin. I'm sorry, I can't pronounce. I'm just gonna call you Martin, if that's okay with you. Um, so yeah, this is definitely a recommendation. You had a review on Ghostface uh, from Screen Four figure. It was the um, zombie mask, I believe. And I saw in the background that you had a, some kind of ghost face mask. So this is definitely recommended for you. I got it pretty cheap. That's my review of my Easter Unlimited ghost face uh, fun world mask. Yeah, recommended mask. Hope you liked the review. See you guys later.